Hi, welcome to the new video series for the Hooked and Lock Call 2021. We will be making this uh, blanket and we will be using the log cabin uh, technique. And that means that we start here in the middle and then we do this block, then this block and we go all the way around. Uh, but there's something special about this blanket. Um, it is interwoven, but at the back um, you will see that I developed a technique uh, for making uh, the blocks stand out uh, more, um, yeah, more nicely. And I will explain everything about that in this video series. Uh, first, I want to tell something about uh, the colors that I uh, used. I used a Scheepjes Color Crafter and I used um, five colors for um, the, the, the main uh, colors, five different colors. And uh, the large blanket that you just saw is done with this white on the background. And um, I first also started with this color and that you can see here and uh, well I didn't actually like the combination with the the soft pastel color so I, I put this aside and but you can see here that you have more um, difference in, in colors and that you can see the patterns very very clearly um, so that's an option too but you know um, if you want to use other colors just take a look on the Scheepjes website they have lots of colors with Color Crafter so you can choose your own colors and what I will also do is um, I will uh, have a block um, graph on my website that you can download and you can uh, draw your colors in it so you can decide if you want to have more colors, less colors, other colors and what I will also provide with this uh, pattern is how many, how much yarn is used for each block so if you have for instance a lot of color crafter uh, from other projects from Scheepjes and uh, you want to uh, use that up then you can see on my website which block uses how much yarn and so you can make your own uh, your own color scheme um, something that I want to tell you about yeah the start of this project when I started thinking of this and uh, you can see here that I um, tried a couple of things out to see what um, worked best and here you see that I made these first blocks and they are kind of separated and uh, well with interwoven the, 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 the corners is always something that you have to pay attention with designing and well I didn't actually like the result it was too loose too open so I skipped that and then I made this one and then you can see you have more consistency here it's more firm and when you look at the back um, you see here that these blocks are not very clearly divided from each other um, and another thing that kind of annoyed me was this uh, if you have a, a huge contrast between colors then you have here you have this this white peeking through and I really wanted to avoid it and that's why I developed a different way of crocheting uh, these blocks together and uh, well you can see the result here on the back you see it, it all these blocks are more separated from each other and they have really nice borders and you can also see here that you don't have at the sides here you don't have these colors uh, mixing so um, well this was the introduction and uh, let's get started <laughs> 